What's up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Today's video is brought to you guys by iSkySoft and we're taking a look at some of the best PDF editors that you can possibly get. Now I've thoroughly reviewed almost all of these and done full on tutorials and a lot of them have the same basic functionality. However, some of them are just quicker to work with. The interface is just simpler. Last but not least, the best PDF editor is a perfect hybrid of all of those. It has OCR text recognition and as you guys can see, the text recognition works brilliantly. You're able to highlight, you're able to edit text and it will Re recreate that text in the perfect font and then of course the interface is just simple enough as you can see we have so if you just mess around with this for a few minutes or maybe a I don't know maybe even like 20 minutes you can learn everything in a few minutes you can edit your PDF pretty nicely the OCR works extremely well. You can throw in links into this. You can edit images, like the images that, and this is something that I noticed that iSkySoft does the best, and it's be able to take images and resize them directly from the PDF. Some of the other platforms have a little bit of trouble doing this. Sometimes they squash the image the wrong way, and it just doesn't look the same. Once again, you can also add in things like uh, certain groups, and then you can mark it up using different colors, highlight certain text, and the highlight uh, functionality works very, very seamlessly, but that's not to say you don't have other functions functionality like being able to cross things out or just a draw with a pencil and then be able to erase certain parts of it that's also functionality that's very important in terms of this so all in all I would say all three of them are pretty good it just depends on what you're looking for ice cream apps is very simple it doesn't have all the functionality you could possibly need but on the other hand it's like free and then Wondershares is kind of expensive so on the other hand if you want to unlock everything and be able to use all the features then that might be the way to go but that's also like very very professional then we have ice sky softs as I mentioned super seamless easy to use and of course the perfect hybrid of between being simple and easy to use but also having all the important functionality for you to be able to edit a very complicated PDF right now what we're taking a look at is a PDF editor from ice cream apps and their PDF editor is pretty good the design is all right it's kind of gray ish and it's able to do a lot like you can add in notes you can annotate you can uh, throw in a pay for example this PDF has almost 90 pages I can go and throw throw in a square real quick and then lighten it up just a little bit and add a little bit of flair to this particular magazine. You can also go ahead and add a few billion circles and add lines and all this other thing. So for touching up, this PDF editor is really good. However, it doesn't have all the functionality that you could possibly want. For example, this particular PDF editor, when you go and convert the text from a normal PDF to a normal text that you try to go and edit, sometimes it doesn't capture all the different uh, words that you possibly want it to capture and sometimes you're just not able to work with it occasionally on this I've had issues with maybe uh, the only issue I've had is too many pages and whatnot but it's all in all not too too bad all right, so next off, we got ourselves Soda PDF. Now, this is pretty awesome because it goes very, very in-depth. You see, this software right here allows you to do just about everything you can possibly dream of with your PDF document, but that also comes with a slight problem. You see, since it allows you to do crazy things like flip the pages like a literal book, it also means that it's a bit heftier in price, and it also means that there is a steep learning curve. You need to learn what all of these different things mean. It's kind of like learning Excel all over. There are just a billion different options. You can take things from your scanner, you can convert them into .text files, transfer those to your iPhone. There's everything like built-in spell check. You can readjust things with a built-in ruler onto here. And then when things get even more complicated, for example, there are some options on here. I don't even know what they do. There are options options that allow you to sanitize the document. I'm not even sure what that means, but thankfully when you hover over things, it does low key tell you what to do. There is built in OCR, but once again, it's just super complex and anyone who's never used OCR before or eSign before is just going to be very, very confusing. Thankfully, they do allow you to have customized tools over here, which is kind of nice. But regardless, this is full fledged software. So if you're doing things for business, this makes a bit more sense, but it is complicated. Check out the links below. Thank you for watching. This is going to be me logging off.